G'day everyone, it's Al here from Fishing Mad and thanks for tuning in to another episode. Well today we are fishing at Western Port. It's a nice late start for us, had a bit of a sleep in. Now the fishing action has been red hot in this area to start snapper season. Got a couple of good mates with me. They've never fished Western Port before. They've caught plenty of snapper, but nothing from this area. So we're hoping to get those guys onto a couple of really good fish and hopefully it'll be a cracking way to fish the afternoon and the evening. I think it should be a fun episode guys. So sit back and enjoy the show. Your snapper, man. Yeah, look at the head checks on it. Jeez, that was the tiniest little. You're just sitting there in the current. Yeah. We're just sitting on it. Well, first decent fish of the day. That's bigger than what we thought it was going to be. Some head checks. Sitting there in the current on top of it. Yeah. That's going around. <coughs> yep, that's a snapper. Guarantee you. Holy moly. Um, yep, do you is. want these rods out of the way? Uh, no, should be alright. I'll bring them around. Here's that was the tiniest little nibble. He's so heavy though. And he's going to come up. He's using, yeah. very... he's using the current. Right. Yeah. Go, go, go. Yep, yep. Head chase. Oh, yeah. Oh, yes. <laughs> Finally, this is going to be a good fish. Is it a gummy? No, nah, it's a snapper for oh, sure. Oh, oh, it's a big red. Oh, that's worth the wait, guys. <laughs> that is my cheese, I, I was, I'm going to put this rod down here yeah. just so I can film this. That is a massive, that is a massive red. red. And look at the bright colours on it. Take your time, man. To all the people that are watching, this is the brightest. Just be patient. How gentle was that nibble? That is Mate, it was literally it's like nibble. a tiny little flathead nibble. It's like a flathead in Western yeah. Port. That's what it felt like. Oh, yeah. Oh, big Don't you, Mate, this is a 70. This is yeah, a good over, fish. Over this is a good fish. 100%. This is beauty. Yeah. He's using the current, so. What was that on, Fads? Uh, that was on the strip of squid. Gray squid we caught the other day, so. Yeah. Oh, He's I, got some weight on You could tell the head yeah. shakes instantly. It's literally yeah. just holding bottom, so. Take your time. Yeah, I don't want to put the drag up, so. Did you see how red he was? Yeah, yeah it was beautiful. Yeah. Red. Oh, it's red. Sitting on the mud banks. I'm going to come way over here because I want to. Yeah, we sit this out. Oh, it's coming up, it's coming up. Get there ready to let it. There we go. Oh, that's a nice, nice fish, dude. Don't scare him with the net. <laughs> yeah, that's a nice red. That's a nice fish. That's what I've been waiting for. <laughs> Up. I had a hunter would come here, didn't I? Oh, oh one, that's mate. a beast! That's, man. A, that's over 70. That's over 70. Guaranteed. Oh. Don't want to push it. <laughs> it is loose, but... I'm I'm really tired. I really don't want to push it. No. Can't lose this one. No, this is a good fish. Oh, you can see the easy clip. Yeah. Far out. Get ready, I'll just keep it sideways. So right. I'll bring him straight in. Ready? Here we go, here we go. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Hang on. No. <laughs> oh. He's got a lot of power, man. Oh, this is a Not good fish. fish. This is a good fish. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Go, Oz. Oh. That's it, man. Oh. Woo. Well done, brother. We got well them, boys. Done. Well done, man. <laughs> Look at that. All right, there we go. Man, what a fight. Beautiful fish. Look at that. Oh. Look at the beautiful red colours on it though. Look at that. That is a magnificent fish. What are we guessing? 72, 73, yeah, something yeah, like that? Yeah, probably low 70s, yeah. <laughs> beautiful fish, man. That was a good fight. <laughs> well done, Well brother. worth it. So I well thought done. I'd run you through the setup and the gear because Western Port is a very unique system. 
very, very tidal. And if you're not used to fishing here, there's a few tips and tricks in here that might help you. So these are the rods that I'm running with. So this season got something a little bit new. So these are the Shimano extraction rods. So these are a 15 to 30 pound. And what I have done is I've paired those with the brand new Shimano Stratic SWB. So that's 6,000 size. Really, really nice. The new generation, they've done some improvements to the drag and the internal components. And that there is a really, really nice combo. So last year I was running the Atomics. And I think the year before that I was running the Raiders. So this is a really, really nice upgrade. It's nice and sturdy. So perfect for this form of fishing. You could be using it for Western Port or Port Phillip Bay. But because it's quite tidal here, it's a little bit sturdier. And I think this works really well. Now, I like to run two rods at the same time. And I like to have two different rigs on those rods. So on the first rod here, I've got a Paternoster rig. So you can either make these yourself or there's a couple of really good local manufacturers that make them that you can buy pre-tied ones. So here I've just got two hooks there where I can present two different baits and you've got your sinker at the bottom. So what I like to do is I like to have that just down and short here on the corner. And the other one that I like to run, and this is probably very typical of what you've seen at Western Port, this is the Western Port Easy Slider Rig. So what we've got here is just a double snell that I've tied. We've got some video tutorials on how to do that. So a couple of six O's there. A Lumo bead. I like to run a Lumo sleeve. I think just a little bit of attractant. That looks really cool. And then we've got probably about 70 centimeters there, a fluorocarbon leader. That then goes to a swivel. And on the end of that, we have got an easy rig slider. And then what I do is run about 20 centimeters or 30 centimeters so of fluoro to your clip there. And that's so you can chop and change your sinkers nice and easily. And what happens is this guy runs up and down your line and that allows you to chop and change the sinker weight nice and easily. And on here, we can present like a nice big strip of squid or some other chunk bait that works really, really well. Now, when you are fishing Western Port, you need to have a whole range of sinkers with you because depending on the depth, and most importantly, depending on the time of the tide, what you're gonna find is the water movement and the current is gonna change. So mid tide could be roaring through. You might need something as big as eight or nine ounce sinkers. Starting off now, we're probably gonna start off with something like that, six pound. But as the tide, you're just gonna keep chopping, changing. And basically what you're trying to do is use the minimal amount of weight that you need to get your bait sitting on the bottom. Now, in terms of baits, what we have done is we've got a range of things with us. We went out and fished Queens Cliff the other day. We've got a double bag of squid, which is fantastic. So we've got a heap of squid in here. So we're gonna cut up some of the hoods into squid strips. We're gonna use some of the squid heads, some of the tentacles. We also have been catching a lot of bay trout and Australian salmon. So that makes a great bait. You can use them as chunks or fillets and even your short fin pike or your snook and that will make a tremendous bait. And these areas here, even though snapper is our target species, you're just as likely to catch yourself a nice big gummy shark. So that's a setup. What we're gonna do is we're gonna have a couple of baits on this side. We're gonna have a couple of baits on that side and hopefully we can get the boys stuck into a really good snapper or two. So stick around and let's hope the action's red hot. Oh, you on? Get him. That's it. That was such a finicky hit. Oh, all three of us now, that's good. Oh, oh yeah. Shakes. It's a big one. Take your time off, take your time. <gasps> yeah, let him run. Just no, go. Let him run, that's a bigger one. Yeah, that's a big fish. That's a big one. <laughs> yes. That's what we're after, baby. That's it, take your time, bro. He's a bit me off before. Right, take your time, man. I'll happily get these rods out your way. You want me to do that? Yeah, grab this rod, Fads. Oh, oh. Yeah, yeah. Just let him come first. That's very good. This is what we're after. Back. Yeah, oh. take your time. That could be the biggest of the day, seriously. Look at this thing. Go. That's a massive snapper. Come towards me. It's got all these bites of snapper. Yeah, I know. That was such a finicky. Ozzy, come over. He's still on, yeah? All right, that's all right. All right, Fads, you're on net duty then, man. Yeah, keep reeling, man. All right. Just tell me if, if you get tangled, rod. you get tangled, yeah. Don't yeah. stress. If you get tangled, just don't pull too hard, yeah. Where's your line? He's coming on that side. That's all right. Oh, yeah. One sec, one sec. Yeah, give us that rod if you need to. That's it. Hang on. <laughs> go back to that one. A nice cuddle. Yeah. There you go. Beautiful. That's Can it. Good around. job, Fads. All right, you're now on net duty. That went on a good run, That's man. That's a good fish, man. That's a good fish. All right. That's it. Oh, oh he's a good one. He's a good one. Slow. Slow. Oh, he's a good one. Oh, I said, get to bring this side. Got to bring him this side. 
He is a good fish. You're gonna have to go closer to net him. Hang on, hang on, hang on. How do you feel? How's that, man? So good. <laughs> hang on, I'm rough. Oh my god. First time fishing Western Port, but thanks to Alan, I caught this stonker. What a beautiful fish. Beautiful, man. That's a ripper. Have a look at the head on that thing. And the head on that thing. <laughs> That's Thanks, awesome. Alan. Good on you, man. That's awesome. All right, there we go. Look at that for a beautiful fish. That's a big boy. Another big one. Another one in there. Oh, it's a nice fish. Not as big as yours, Fads, but that's a nice fish. Oh, look at the colours on it. Whoo! Well done, man. Yeah, that one didn't work. Finally. Oh, yes. <laughs> oh. All right, so there we go there. So certainly not as big as Fads fish before. It's a beautiful eating size. So he's probably a little bit over 50 centimetres. The one we got before was in the mid 70s. So. All right, and right now we're moving into that peak fishing time. So we've got about an hour and a half before sundown and we're right in the middle of that run in tide. And I think we might get a little bit more action. And we've been able to turn a reel and test in that new extraction rod, an SWB Stratic. And uh, that's another one there that'll go on ice. So we've got everyone on the board today, but uh, there you go. What a beautiful fish. Well, that's a wrap everyone, fishing here at Western Port. And as I said, we launched early afternoon. It's not quite sundown yet, probably got an hour or so before that, but we're gonna head in. It's been a really fun day. It started off pretty slow. We got that one that was about 73 centimeters early. My mate Fad caught that one. And then there was a little bit of a time lapse. And then we had a crazy run. We got into some really good fish and it was great to see everyone turn a reel. And we've got an esky full of some absolutely awesome quality snapper. Western Port's a very unique fishery. A few little things can make a massive difference. We've done a lot of stuff today, a lot of different baits, a lot of different moves. And you know what? It's great to come out here and get stuck into a few great fish locally within Victoria. Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoyed the episode and we'll see you sometime soon. Take care, everyone. Here we go. How's she feeling? Not big yet. It hasn't done anything yet. That's nah, a little one. Oh, it's a little draft board shark. It's not even a, um, <laughs> it's not even a schoolie. These are like pest of the pest. But you gotta watch your fingers on these things, right? Yeah? If you enjoyed the episode, then become a Fishing Mad member. It's easy to join by visiting www.fishingmad.com.au forward slash member and gain access to an online portal that's full of helpful fishing content, including detailed workshops, fishing reports, rigging tutorials, podcasts, giveaways, competitions, maps, gear reviews, sounder training, exclusive videos, and much more. It's a great platform and helps to support everything we do at Fishing Mad, so become a member today.